Yo, 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 what is up, everybody? Chris here from Fake Sports News, back at it again with another video. Today, I'm going to be bringing you guys a quick recap as to what happened during the last day of the Stage 4 Major, that, of course, being Championship Sunday, as well as what you can expect going into today's matches, that, of course, being Day 1 of Stage 5. Of course, looking back at the results, you guys see I picked Optic to topple Empire and Ultra, and obviously the opposite came true. Empire ended up doing this. So Empire beat Optic 3-1. Then Empire went on to reverse sweep Ultra. And then Empire went on to go to game nine with FaZe, uh, where my home team, of course, that being Atlanta FaZe, you get your two FaZe up, shot my boy Selium. Um, they walked away from the round nine. Uh, and they won 6-2 in the S&D. So pretty comfortable raid to S&D to close out the tournament for them. And, of course, that's their third major win this year. Um, and at this point, they are... No, I'm sorry, it was 6-4 on raid. Um, but... At this point, they've already super locked in champs. I think they probably locked in champs like a month ago. Uh, I think they've only lost out on like 30 or 40 points this season, which is insane. Uh, the extra points they would have gotten from the Toronto matchup if they beat them at Major 2, and then the series that they lost to NYSL and LAG, those are the only points they missed out on this season. So I guess that totals to what, uh, 45 points? So insane. Um, they've almost gone undefeated this year. And I mean, it's insane. Yeah, it just doesn't make sense. Um, so they beat Empire, of course, 5-4. And they are going up against London Royal Ravens to start off action today. Uh, so kicking off stage five, we, of course, will see face taking on the London Royal Ravens. And you guys know I'm going to back my home team, my number one team at this point. Uh, Atlanta Faze, the team to beat uh, in COD really just in general in the cod league in Warzone, if you put those guys in anything cod related they will win um i think it's a 3-0 honestly i think it's a 3-0 for the face side london did not have a great showing at the major and honestly i felt like if they had a good showing at the major they could possibly chain that into season five or stage five if you will but honestly with their very lackluster performance given the fact that they were finally starting to click right before the major hit and then they hit the major and their vets are playing not well um i think that's the kind of thing that really kind of takes the wind out of your sails as a team now one could say that they probably have gone back to the drawing board and they're probably going to play really hard in stage five but i just don't know that you have it after such a let's say gut-wrenching performance or a, a really devastating loss is a better way of saying it um so for that reason i say phase 3-0 and just I mean, let's be honest, FaZe has been in the best form that we've seen of any COD team ever, I would say. Um, even at Optics height, they weren't really this dominant for this long. Uh, the entirety of a year where no team could really take a, a chip off their shoulder, if you will, or a, a chip off the block. That's what I was looking for, the analogy. Um, I don't know, man. This seems just different. So I say 3-0 on their side. And they probably go 5-0 again to close out stage 5, if I'm being honest. I don't know who they would lose to in their group. Um, I know Chicago's there. New York is there. Uh, New York with the team might be the team to beat them. Or Chicago if they can finally figure it out. But I just don't think it's too likely. Um, so yeah, 3-0 phase. And then, of course, in our next matchup of the day, we will see Optic Chicago taking on the Paris Legion. You guys know I always back Optic to beat Paris. Um, and that's not going to change today. I just think their personnel is stronger. Zapdius, Temp, of course, Scraps, and Aqua versus Skump, Envoy, Dashy, Formal. Uh, we all know who we would all pick 10 times out of 10. So I'll say 3-1 Optic. I think that the S&D is going to be a toss-up. Both are strong search teams based on last stage. Optic definitely improved considerably in search. And their hard point looked to be a little bit shaky, so maybe they've gotten better at it. I know they played Dallas recently, and Dallas said that they've been playing really, really well. So I don't know what to make of that. Um, we'll see how things go when they get to land because Crim6 said that Chicago are onliners, which I didn't think about it, but I guess they really are at this point. Uh, they went to land and kind of didn't go well. Uh, well, the two times they faced Dallas, granted. But uh, yeah, online, they've definitely looked really good. And then land, they should have been different, but they weren't. So we'll give Optic another chance. Uh, I mean, we have one more stage left. They could come out and perform at the right time in the year. Formal might hit V20 again. Um, this might be IW Champs Formal all over again. If that's the case, then the league needs to be scared. But back to brass tacks.
three one off to gaming is my call um and i will take that to the bank i think three oh phase three one optic and i think that's the day right there it's good to be back um sorry for the ranting and raving a little bit i just kind of had a lot of thoughts to get out since we've had such a long uh hiatus between of course stage four and five so yeah good to be back and hope you guys enjoy the video hope you enjoy all the cod action some of this might be trimmed down so if things don't make sense i talked a lot and probably edited a lot out so yeah guys hope you have a great morning new night wherever you may be on this beautiful planet and i hope you guys enjoy all the cod and i will catch you guys on the next video so once again this is chris from fake sports news and i'm signing off peace out hope you guys have a great morning new year night wherever you may be on this beautiful planet and i'll catch you on the next video peace out okay just trying something new for the outro but uh i hope you guys like that little auctioneer style outro super fast super aggressive but uh yeah peace out everybody have a great day